your girl Missy Magic and I'm back with another episode of In the Life with Missy Magic to my new people. Hey y'all, I'm Missy Magic to my returning people. Welcome back y'all. my phone recording me recording on my camera if that makes sense if y'all got it if you didn't you get it when you get home like your pastor used to say but today is june 24th it's 12 11 i'm on lunch i'm at babylon um get my oil changed on lunch because i need an oil change um but this vlog is gonna be um basically a vacation prep so i go on my first trip well i went to atlanta in may but that was like a family trip or whatever. I'm going on my first girls trip of the year. Next week, we are going to New Orleans. I've been to New Orleans a few times, well, twice. So we're going to New Orleans. Um, and y'all know exactly why I'm going to New Orleans in the New Orleans vlog. I ain't gonna say too much. Y'all know where I'm going, that's all you need to know. So today, I have a nail appointment, a nail and pity appointment. Um, I have to schedule my appointment for my hair. I'm gonna get my hair done tomorrow and I have a lash appointment in the morning. I have to just go run a few errands just to, you know, prep for vacation, like I said. So I'm just gonna take y'all along with me all day today and tomorrow so y'all can prep with me for vacation. So I just wanted to get on here and do my little intro and let y'all know, you know, what this vlog is gonna be about good morning y'all it's the next morning yes i got out of bed just like this well i wash my face to brush my teeth um but your girl got her nails done on last night um i was tired so after i got my nails done i came home well i stopped to get something eating i came home and i went to bed well i started watching zoe 101 on that on netflix and then i went to sleep so let me show y'all what i got yesterday just so i show y'all so i got me some new luggage like i got a carry-on because all i need is a carry-on bag because we fly southwest you get two free check bags so that's what i'm gonna do um i got a carry-on bag already but it doesn't roll like this it only rolls like this if y'all know what i mean so i got one that does like this easier for me at the airport um it was $70 from TJ Maxx. But what I love about this, for one, I love the color. And I don't even like pink like that. But I love a like soft pink. So I love this color. And then they got like a little port where you can charge your phone. And I'm like, okay, that's why it's $70 because of this. But um, that's what I love. So I got that yesterday from TJ Maxx. I got more. I got more traveler uh, travel block bottles because it's four of us going on a trip, but three of us on one flight, and you see these only two packs, so I need another pack for all three of us. So I got all three of us covered now with these. Put us some liquor in there, and then lastly, I got these travel uh, luggage tags. They are so cute. This one says adventure, let's escape, and then sunsets and palm trees. And you know, it's like if you ever lose your luggage, you can write your name and then your number. And so I'm going to just tag that on my suitcase. So yeah, I'm not, I wouldn't say that I'm bougie, but I do love nice things. Um, and I try to keep myself together, but a lot of times... I don't like sitting to get services. I for sure keep my hair done. I get my hair done like once a month. But my nails, I ain't had them done since the beginning of the year, like January. Because I don't like sitting there. It took her like two and a half hours to do this sit. And I don't have the patience to sit there no more. Um, but I'm going to say that I'm bougie, but I like nice things. And I like to be put together. So I got all my travel, well, some of my travel stuff on yesterday from TJ Maxx. All of that came from TJ Maxx, by the way. If y'all want to go get it, um, that's where it came from. So, uh, it's Saturday, June 25th. Um, it is 7.30 in the morning. I'm about to wash my frontal and wash my bundles. Because I have a hair appointment today at 12.30. 
Um, and I also need to wash my hair. And then I also want to go running this morning. So I'm going to try to go ahead and get my hair and my bundles not at the way. So I can go running because I have a lash appointment at 9.30. I like to do mine back to back. So I can get it over with. And then I'll probably go get a pedicure after I get my hair done. Um, and then... Yeah, that's the agenda. I still have one video for sure to shoot today. Uh, outside of this one. Once I get my hair done or whatever. Um, so, I'm pretty booked and busy today. <laughs> I'm usually That's usually how it is on a weekend. Since I'm off every weekend. And I'm so busy Monday through Friday with my job. And my channel as well. Um, but that's a little rundown. So, I'm going to take Unix to use the bathroom. And then I'm going to go wash my bundles. And then get my day started. All right, y'all. So I'm at the house. It is 9:16. I'm on the way to my last appointment. I didn't have a chance to go walk in. I wanted to walk a whole two miles this morning, and it's crazy because I woke up at like 6:20, but didn't get out the bed till seven. So if I would have got out the bed as soon as I woke up at 6:20, I probably would have been able to get that two mile in, well two miles in. But I was able to wash my bundles and wash my hair. Y'all can't really see. But I am on the way. It says that I'm gonna make it to my last appointment at 9:29. My appointment is at 9:30. And on her website, it says it's only gonna take her an hour and a half. But every time I get my lashes done, it take them two hours plus. Cause I have a lot of lashes. Like my lashes not really long, but they are always full. I always have like a whole bunch of lashes on my eyelid. Um, so. I bought the hair because I was going to go back home and dry this hair because it's not dry. But I'm just sitting in the sun because my hairstylist is in the same like plaza of suits, uh, suites that the girl is doing my lashes. And I was like, I'm not going all the way back home because it's 15 minutes from the house. That don't make no, no sense. So uh, once I finish getting my lashes done, I'm going to go to the hair store and find me some blonde hair. So, y'all will see how my hair is going to be. So, just stay tuned and I'll check in with y'all. Probably when I'm done get my lashes done and I'm headed to the hair store. So, got my lashes done. I really thought it was going to take her like 2-4 hours. My appointment was at 9.30. I didn't think she was going to be done until 11.30. It is 10.56, so right at 11. My hair appointment is not until 12.30. But, I'm already over here so I got to go to the hair store. Find me some blonde hair that can take high heat, she said, because I'm getting curls. Y'all gonna love this style that I'm gonna get. Never got it before. I'm always trying this stuff with my hair. But, um, yeah, I didn't know that it was gonna be like this bold because I got hybrid and these giving volume, baby. Almost mega volume. But I'm finna look up a hairstyle and then head to the hairstyle to get me some hair. Alright, y'all, so. I was able to, I had to go to two hair stores and I was able to find what I needed. I got this right here. Queen hair. Queen hair, 14 inch blonde. Or 213. Same thing. Um, and I forgot to tell y'all, like, when I got my lashes done earlier, that was my first time getting my lashes done in a recliner chair. And I always be knocked out at my appointments, but when I tell you, I was so comfortable. And it was cold in there. Usually, I can't go to sleep without no cover when I'm cold. That's how you know I was comfortable. I was knocked out, and I woke up right when she was finishing. So, I feel like all last tech should get the little recliner chair. But I'm at my hair appointment. I'm finna brush my bundles out and then go in and get my hair done. And I'll check in with y'all when I'm done. Cause y'all know Missy Magic gon' step every motherfucking time. Don't play with me. Look at this. Don't motherfucking play with me. Period. Cause I'm pulling off anything and it looks the fuck good. Okay. Yes, Missy Magic is back in motherfucking business, honey. Period. But I'm finna call Tiz cause they got Pride in Nashville this weekend. He called me, asked me, was I going? So I'm gonna take that as he want me to come and I'm gonna go because your girl looking fine as hell. Yes, I'm coming. And I'm gonna record. That's a video. 
All right, y'all, I guess Tess couldn't find like where Pride was downtown Nashville. So I just parked and we're about to eat at Joe's Crab Shack. I never had Joe's Crab Shack before. It's crazy. If I have, it was when I was younger and on vacation, but I'd have been so many places. I don't remember ever having Joe's Crab Shack. So that's what we doing. Just had to update y'all. I got us the table already, but they playing this music in here, so y'all know I'm not gonna be a good for long. All right, y'all, we are leaving Joe's Crab Shack. The service was terrible, honey. The service was terrible, but my food was good. Um, so when we back to this one, this location, cause the service was terrible, but my food was fine. I got shrimp, fish, and fries. My shrimp was grilled, fish was fine. But now we're about to head to Nashville Pride, cause he found where it's at. All right, y'all, we made it to Pride. Fucking dead. How y'all doing today? <laughs> is back on the camera, you know, about to dick somebody's son. Y'all think I'm playing? I'm so scared. So we here. I've never been to Pride, y'all. So this is gonna be a first experience for me. To me, it's your first time. Yes. And y'all, I support gay people, but I'm not gay, so I hope no female <laughs> don't try to talk to me while I'm in here. I might be going oh, that way if anybody wants to, you know, get that way. <laughs> she like her pussy ate, pussy ate well. <laughs> well. Her legs shaking and all. all right. <laughs> Period. You need that clip, the bow was it. Period. Y'all, so they have a bar like out here. Oh, we keep walking. Keep walking. <laughs> We're going to keep walking to see what's on down. Y'all. I got me a frozen lemonade, frozen strawberry lemonade. And I ain't gonna be out here spending all this money. I'm gonna stay in there. But it's good. It's real good. And it's hot out here, so I need something refreshing. Yeah, when I say it's hot as hell out here, it's hot as hell. I'm surprised my curls ain't fail yet. They still look the fuck good, okay? And I need to be drinking on some water instead of this lemonade. But this lighting fire, baby. But I want to show y'all some of these folks, but I don't know how people feel about being on camera. <laughs> Tez, what did you get to drink? I got a, um, which is which? Uh, this is a um, Red Bull vodka, and this is a uh, Summer's tequila, which is a big tequila and something. How they taste? Oh, strong as hell, honestly. I ain't even gonna say it's good. Yeah. But it's good for me because that's how I like it. Tamir, what did you get? Strawberry lemonade. I got, it tastes like vodka. I like them. Strike lemon. Strike lemon. With capital K's and Q's. <laughs> With a capital A's. Oh my God. Let's talk about Alright y'all, your girl got the fuck up out of there. Excuse my language up in this vlog, but it's hot as hell. Thank God my motherfucking frontal ain't came off. But I'm leaving. I'm going home. But I hope y'all enjoyed this vlog. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see y'all in the next episode of In the Life with Missy Magic.